So, okay guys, there's lightning outside, there's thunder outside, there's a storm going on outside my house right now, and I sat down on the computer, it's nighttime, and I'm like, you know, I want a scary game to play. And I saw this in the Steam, Steam store, and I was like, you know what, I'd love The Walking Dead show. I would love to play this game, uh, if only to find out if it's, if it's fun or horrible. <laughs> so, I can take you guys on this little adventure with me, and you can let me know what you think as well. So, let's play this. It's not an expensive game, though. It's only like $24.99 right now. So, from what I understand, it'll come in several different episodes. Um, but I hope this uh, helps you find out if this is something you want to uh, take part in. Uh, more help from the UI. Let's do standard. Let's do this. I have no idea what to expect, guys. So, just to let you know. <laughs> so, if I'm terrible at this to begin with, I've never seen this before. I have no idea what to expect. I like that, tailored to the way I play. Oh, let me turn the lights out in my room too. Let's let's get the let's get the feeling going. Creepy. I like it. Episode one. Okay. I'm just going to get into it. I'm just going to watch this, this intro. See what the, the graphics direction? I kind of dig it. It's something different. I like it. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. You know what they say about reckoning? Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. Every time? Every time. Use a mouse, take a look around. I followed your case a little bit, you being a making boy and all. What? Okay, okay. You're from Macon, then? Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. Always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real shame, that is. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. I can look around. Okay. I got a nephew up at UGA. Am I supposed to you be looking there for long? something? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? Sure. A lot of cops going by. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Seem important to you? All of them, but that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you drive yourself crazy. That's, that's, I think I've seen that same car like three times. I'm though. driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over, right where you're sitting. Are available for incoming to one and fuck? before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like like a fussy baby on an airplane. Not tell him he's got to stop, but that's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. 
So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. The fuck? Maybe he was innocent. Innocent? They caught the fucker red-handed, <laughs> stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. What was that in the middle? Oh, I got another good one for you. This one's a little oh, bit shit. less depressing and a oh, bit shit. more hilarious if I do say so. What this out? other time... <laughs> Officer, are you all right? I'm still cuffed back here. Kick that window. I need to drag myself out that window. Use the W key, look at the door, use them. Climb out. Okay. It's fucked up. Where's that shotgun? Oh, where's... Get that fucking shotgun. Get that fucking shotgun. The officer's shotgun is over there. Yeah. Looks empty. Oh, fuck. It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. You mean, you want me to... Mm. <laughs> Not going anywhere without that shotgun. Why would he have needed that? Fuck, man. Pick up that shotgun. Looks empty. I don't care. Put the shotgun shell in there. Holy shit. It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. Okay, let's try. Let's try. <laughs> um. Oh, motherfucker, man. I know you're going to make me go over here to the zombie. Officer? Man, fuck you. Okay, let's do it. God damn. Officer? Are you fucking kidding me? <sighs> yep. See? Officer. Are you fucking kidding me? Holy shit. 
Kick that oh, Kick that motherfucker. What in the hell? Back the fuck up. Back the fuck up. Oh shit. Oh shit. Get away from me! Back the fuck up. Back the fuck up. Are you fucking kidding me? Get that fucking gun. Get that fucking gun. Where are you? Get the fucking shotgun shell. What the fuck is wrong with you, Butterfingers? Holy shit. Shoot him. Don't make me do this! I don't care. Shoot his fucking ass. Holy shit. Holy shit. Man. That was... It's all rotten and he smells like shit. What the hell is this? Can I move? What else am I supposed to see? I can't move. There's nothing else to see or do. Are you dead? Hey! Are you dead? <laughs> I think it's dead on me. Oh shit, look at that. Help! Go get someone! There, there's been a shooting! Holy shit. What the fuck is that? Oh no. Ah! Yeah, you better get your ass up and act right. Ah! Oh my god. I got the clumsiest ah! goddamn guy in the world.